Hello? Department is to inform you that there's a legal enforcement actions filed on your name for fraudulent activities. So, when you get the reason you have received this phone call from our department is to inform you that there's a legal enforcement actions filed on your name for fraudulent activities. So, when you get this message, kindly press 1 to discuss with available officer. You have reached Social Security Administration office. My name is Officer Charles Williams. How can I help? Yeah, what's going on? What's your age? How old you are? What? How old you are, sir? I'm what's 68. Your age? You're 68. That's okay. Are you on a disability? Can you walk towards the CVS pharmacy or a grocery store? Can yeah, you walk? I, Do you drive? Yeah, I drive. Okay, first of all, let me tell you, sir. Because I'm just asking this question to you, we have an order to suspend your social security number right this moment. We have got an order to suspend because there are a lot of criminal activities going on under your social security. Can you go get gift cards and for me? I call you to protect yourself as the data we have in our system. Are you what? aware you have an arrest warrant issued under your social security? When did that happen? Beg your pardon? When did that happen? It happened an, a week ago. We found a car which was abandoned in a city. Hey, sorry, I have to go be my grandpa now. Bye. Found registered under your social security. And this car was containing illegal substance, cocaine, marijuana, crystal meth, and also heroin. Now, since it was drug, then was the U.S. Drug Enforcement Administration Act Section 28 under United States Code 134 is the case out. Very far me, first of all, if you are willing to cooperate with me, I'm going to remove your name with this case. I'm going to help you in this yeah, case. Yeah, yeah. If you that's are... not me. That I didn't do. That's not me. Okay, okay. Let I me didn't ask do you one that. thing. If you are not the person, listen to me. If you are not the person who did this all kind of activity, we farm your name over there. Huh? What's your name? Full name. Bo. What's your full name, sir? Yeah, it's Richard Johnson. Richard Johnson, give me a moment. Yeah. As I'm not aware you are the right person or not, so I'm just considering you as a criminal as you have committed any crime. If you are willing to cooperate with me, verify me again, what your social security number, so I'll be make sure I'm speaking with the right person. What? It's a little verify hard to hear you. It's kind of hard to hear you at all. Verify me the social security number of yours, sir. Oh, yeah, it's uh, 343. Are you right now? What's your current zip code? Six zero six five two. Six zero six five two. Can you verify me the name of the city? Where's the name of the city? Is, is it? Chicago. Chicago, Illinois. Am I correct? Yeah. Okay. Verify me, sir. As you claim, you are not the person who did all the criminal activities. So do one thing. I believe you. I believe you, I'm going to help you in this case. Do one thing, I'm going to remove your name with this case, and I'm going to transfer this call to my chief officer, okay? One of my okay. chief officers will visit you at your premises, at your doorstep, and they will give you a new social security number, because this social security number is compromised. So first of all, let me make you understand about the situation. So do one thing, do you have a pen and paper handy with you right now? Uh... Yeah, uh, yeah. You need me to write something down, or, 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 or absolutely God, this correct. Is, this is kind of all happening so quickly. I don't understand what's going on. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I'm here with you. 
I am here to help you. Okay, don't worry about that. First of all, grab a pen and paper handy with you. I'm going to give you some information which is very important for you. Okay, and then I'll transfer this call to my chief officer. Okay. Uh, go, uh, let me get a let me get a pen. Okay, take your time. Take your time, sir. First of all, you can know down my name. I am an officer, Social Security Administration. My name is Officer Charles Williams. My first name is Charles. My last name is Williams. Did you get that, sir? Charles Williams. Yep. Williams, absolutely correct. Okay, you know down Charles. my badge, ID number. You yep. can know down my badge, ID number. My badge, ID number is S as in Sam. S, S. as in Sam. A as in Alpha. S. S S A. Okay. S zero five seven seven. A A zero. Eight zero five seven seven. Eight zero five seven seven. You can also note down the case ID number. The case ID number is D D as in David. C C as in Charlie. Seven zero one zero. Seven zero one three zero one zero ending with zero. Oh. You can also note down the warrant number which is against your social, which is under your name. The worst warrant number is five four six four one one. Say that again. I'm five four. Uh huh. Six, uh -huh. four. Six, four, one, one. 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 Okay. Absolutely correct. You can, can you please verify me what have you written in my badge, ID number, to make sure you have written the correct one? Sorry, say that one more time. What's my badge, ID number you have written over there, sir? Oh, your badge. Uh, I think that's SSA mm -hmm. 80577, if I'm not mistaken. No, absolutely correct. Yeah, you are right. Absolutely correct. Do one thing. I'm going to give you the information further. Now, even proceed ahead with the case, I need you to understand that this is a federal recorded and monitored by the FBI and U.S. Marshal. Okay. So whatever answer you will be giving over this recorded line, it has to be at most honest. You are not supposed to disconnect the line in between while I'm solving the case for you. Is that clear? Yeah, yes. Mr. Johnson? All right. So right now, yes, you are aware. You are aware now you have an arrest warrant issued under your social. We are putting this arrest warrant on hold because we have already checked your past banking and your social information, your records to be clean, uh -huh. which is why we believe you, you are not a criminal, okay? Okay. So I'm going to explain what exactly happened. Listen to me carefully. Do not interrupt me in between. I will be highly appreciated to you if you are not going to be interrupting me in between while I'm reading out the charges against you. Sorry, I, I so can't. So shall I start now? Yeah, sorry. Go. Could I? Can I? Am I am I in trouble right now? No, no, not at all, sir. You are not in trouble. Okay. You are an innocent person. We have already checked your past banking and your social information. Your records be clean, which is why we are considering you as an innocent person. Right now, I'm going to give you a solution about this situation. Listen to me okay, carefully. Okay, thank God. Okay? Thank the God. reason you have yeah. a drug... You have... Listen to me. The reason you have a drug trafficking case I, is because we you. found... Yeah. Okay, Go the ahead. reason you have a drug trafficking case is because we found a complaint which was launched by the landowner who resides in the city of Rollett. Instead of Texas, he found a car, the car name was Toyota Corolla 2010 model in color white. Okay. Let me repeat the name of the car. The car name was Toyota Corolla 2010 model in color white. This car okay. was containing illegal substances like cocaine, marijuana, crystal meth, and also heroin. Now, since it involved drugs, they involved the U.S. Drug Enforcement okay. Administration yeah. Act. What? Also, U.S. Marshal and FBI. So first of all, we found this car was registered under your social security and we found you are, therefore you are charged with drug trafficking. Very far me, are you aware about this car, about this situation? No, I'm not aware about any of this. 
You said you found a car. Do you have this car? Toyota a Corolla 2010 model? No. No, I don't have a Toyota Corolla. Okay. No. Do you, what what the car name you have? You, what, what is the car you have? Uh, a Camry. Camry. Do you have Camry car? Am I correct? Yeah. What's the model number, sir? It is 2010 it's a Toyota or? A Toyota Camry. What's the model number, Mac and model number? Huh? What's the name? As you said, you have Camry. Can you verify me? Macking and model number is 2010 model or it's 26 model. What's the name, model of the car? Yeah. Wait, what are you? It's a yeah. Okay. You, you have Camry, right? You don't have Toyota Corolla. No, I don't okay. have a Toyota no, before Corolla. The complaints from the I state have of a state, Camry. Listen to me. Listen to me. Okay, okay. That's what I'm trying listen to, to me, tell sir. you. So, it's I got a, it, sir. It's now, before the complaints from the state of Texas. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, it's, listen it's to me, the, sir. Uh, now, before the complaints. It still has the, it has the CD player and the sunroof. Listen it to me, sir. I'm just reading out the charge. Do not interrupt me in between. Please, okay. I will be highly okay. appreciated to you. Yeah. Now, before yep. complaint from the state of Texas, we also got complaint from Bank of America, Chess Bank, Wells Fargo, PNC Bank, TD Bank, and many more banks, stating there are 10 bank account made under your social and 15 credit cards supplied under your name. So first oh of all, God. I am just asking: Are you dealing with 10 bank account, or you are not dealing with 10 bank account? No, I. No, I don't have bank 10 bank accounts. Uh -huh. I only got, I only got How the many one. Bank belong? I, I only have uh, a checking and a savings, both at Bank of America. You know, about the car, I, I did just save 15 percent. Okay, I'm gonna get give you the information further. Listen to me, sir. As you said, you have Bank of America only one bank checking and savings. Do yeah. you have a debit card with it? Okay, how many credit cards applied in the union? Because we found 15 credit cards applied in the union. Therefore, I'm asking this question, sir. Will you find me how many credit cards do you have? How many credit cards do I have? What are you sir. asking me? I'm oh, just credit asking cards. you also believe the bank account. I have three. Yeah. You have three. Okay, got it. Sir, let me tell you, sir, we also believe the bank account and the drug which were found through an abandoned car has a same connection. According to the U.S. Drug Enforcement Administration Act Section 28, Subsection C, United States Code 1340 said by the courthouse, this criminal activity is performed by one individual or one individual organization. So over this recorded and monitor line, okay. I would like to ask you whether you have Could any relation with the Could you slow down crime? a little bit? I I don't know what you just said. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Now, before we also listen to me, sir, I'm going slow for you, okay? Yeah. We also yeah, believe it's just, the if bank you count. Too the, fast. I can't understand what it is you're saying. And sorry, I'm sorry to, for that. Sorry for I'm that. I'm trying listen to make to me, sure sir. I understand we also all believe, this. And, and I don't want to get in trouble. Oh, at all. definitely, sir. Definitely, definitely, sir. We yeah. also believe the bank account and the drug which was found through an abandoned car, had a same connection. According to the U.S. Drug Enforcement Administration Act, Section 28, Subsection C, under the United States Code 134, it is said by the courthouse, this criminal activity is performed by one individual or one That's individual organization. So over this recorded... Over this recorded and monitor line, I would like to ask you whether you have any relation with the crime, money laundering, and drug trafficking. Uh, no, no, of course not. All right. Since Why you are denying the fact, let me tell you, sir. We are definitely not. You are not the person. You are an innocent person. Therefore, I'm just asking this question to you. I'm, so I'm, very, me, I'm a very you are innocent saying, person. You are not the. I know that. Listen to me, sir. We, Deny as you are denying the fact you don't have any criminal activity nor you are related with a crime, you will have to prove your innocence because the crime has been committed under your social security. Therefore, I am just contacting you. Very far, me, sir. I'm going to transfer this call to my chief officer. 
first of all very for me as you said you have only bank of america can you please help me to differentiate what belongs to you and what belongs to the real culprit um let me verify let me differentiate as you said you have checking and savings with bank of yeah, america you can you help me with the amount how much funds do you have how much funds do you have in a Sorry, bank checking a rough idea like how much funds you have in a savings account a rough idea like 5000 10000 or how much in my in my savings account uh, yeah i'm just asking a rough idea sir to so verify whether you uh, you are have yeah i i usually keep around 20000 in there 20000 okay how much funds do you have in a checking account sir huh how much funds do you have in a checking bank of america oh sorry um Price. I don't know. Uh, a rough 6, idea. 000, you can give me a rough 6, idea. Something like 6, that. Six thousand. Okay. Can you yeah. for me? What kind of? What's your job title, sir? What do you do, sir, for a living? I'm retired. Oh, retired. So you're talking to me on a cell phone, or are you talking to me on a landline? Yep. It's a cell phone. You're talking to me. Oh, it's a cell phone. Okay, got yep. it. So, are you rented a house or you are having your own house? So? Yep. I have my own house. Uh, you have? I've had it for oh, a lot of years. Oh, it's your own house. Yep. Okay, got it. So, can you verify me? Do you have any money in a form of cash in case of emergency? Like 5000 or any, any, any money in a form of cash at your house in a case of emergency? Not, not much. You're still no. over 9,000. How much is it? 100. I beg your pardon? Just over 900. 900. You have $900? Okay, got Pro it. So probably. can you please verify me again? Uh, okay, got it. I'm going to transfer this call to my chief officer who will be guiding you better in this situation, okay? Do not hang up the call at all because he will be guiding you better and he will be removing your name with this case because you are an innocent person so can you please verify me once again your social security number so i'll be make sure um you need me to verify it again you said or what did, what did you want yeah please verify me again the social security number the social security number of your yeah, team please verify me again it's... with Ryan is it Mr. Richard Johansson? Uh, yeah, Richard Johnson. It's Richard Johnson, is that correct? Yeah. Hi, Mr. Johnson, how are you doing today? Uh, I, I, I'm a little bit, a little bit worried if I'm honest. I don't, I don't fully understand what's going on. It's okay to be worried, sir. Uh, let me explain you what exactly is going on. So basically, your social security number is misused for these crimes, which are drug trafficking and money laundering. Basically, we've got these 24 bank accounts under your name and your social security number, yeah. which have been misused to transfer money to Mexico and Colombia. And so we've also got some drugs banks. in an apartment. Yep, yeah, uh, that was 24 in total. And the initially the Social Security Administration only found they Hello? only found ten. But when we further investigated on it, right. So the Social Security Administration were only able to find ten bank accounts on your name. And when we further investigated on it, we found twenty four. As a okay. matter of fact, these apartments that were raided, right, these these apartments that were raided. We have also got reports for drugs that have been seized in these apartments. Drugs like cocaine, heroin, personal meth, marijuana. I mean, all of this seems totally skeptical to us. That is the reason yeah. there's this case on your name. Now, now, if we talk about your innocence, well, sir, uh, you need to understand, Mr. Johnson. My name is Ryan. I'm with the DEA. 
Okay. And I've already checked your past banking and social records, okay? Now, Richard, checking your records, I see that your banking information, it contains genuine records. Yeah. And your social has no other complaints in the past. Right. So right. Th right. that is the reason we believe this is a case of identity theft. Right. And that is why what we can oh, do right okay. now in order to help you out. Yeah. Uh -huh, yeah. In order that's, to help you out. That's what I was can, thinking because I, I, I don't. I actually used to volunteer when they. Yeah, remember uh -huh. the uh, D.A.R.E. programs where they would b bring in the police officers and all that and they'd tell the kids not to do the drugs. Well, I used to volunteer, right, and, I, right. and I would go, and I would go, mm -hmm. and I'd give little presentations, and I used to have a, uh, a little puppet, and I I had this puppet that I'd bring up there on stage, and I'd do a little skit for the kids, you know, and it, it used uh -huh. to be a real hoop. They they loved me over there, and so I, I I'm mm -hmm. I never you know I, I don't support any of those kind of those kind of drugs. Mm -hmm. Right. So, uh, Mr. Johnson, His on this recorded heroin, line, Harry, I, I and he just says no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I still remember it like it was yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, just to inform you, we've got these lines recorded. And uh, Mr. Johnson, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay. Uh, Mr. Johnson, I believe you're aware that these kind of call recordings can be served as evidences in the court of law. Oh, okay, yeah. Right. So what we're going to do now to inform you about this case, the actions that are to be taken on your social security number is to get it suspended. Now, we have to, any which ways, we have to suspend your social security number because we do not want those criminals to use your identity again. Okay. However, tomorrow, now tomorrow, you're going to receive a brand new social security number. And that can only happen when we update your assets and accounts to the courthouse. Now, sir, I would like to ask you on okay. this recorded line that are you ready to cooperate with me on this recorded line and help yourself update your assets and financials to the, to the courthouse? I mean... Yeah, whatever you need. All right. In that case, what I want you to understand here, that the moment I go ahead and suspend your social security number, any asset that is, that is associated with your social, that means any movable or immovable properties along with any liquid assets, well, they're all going to be confiscated along I with this extension. I means, don't drink a whole lot. Maybe I'm misunderstanding. No, it. what, what I'm What's saying your is, question? What's your question? No, that's all right. My, um, I don't have any question here, Mr. Johnson. I want you oh. to know that if I suspend your social right now, anything that you have linked to your social security number that is your immovable properties and movable assets, well, everything is going to be suspended and all of your bank accounts are going to be seized. So in order to stop that from being happening, what uh -huh. I can do is I can guide you everything step by step. You can safeguard your accounts, and we can represent, we can update your assets to the courthouse so that yeah, tomorrow I really appreciate you can that. receive a brand new social security number. Sure. Uh, we can help you receive a new social security number tomorrow, and we can also help you receive a cashier's check that will be of the monetary value of the money that you have okay. in your bank. So right now, in, in order to safeguard it, what I want you to do is... Okay, can you tell me, do you have a driver's license on um, your name? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Right. I want you to take that driver's license, and I want you to take your debit cards, your credit cards, and I want you to get inside your car. I believe you can drive a vehicle, right? Yeah. I mean... And I believe this is your cell phone. Is this your cell phone that I'm talking on? Yeah, you don't mind. You don't mind me asking, just because I'm trying to take notes or whatever. Uh, what, what's okay, your okay. What's your badge ID? Do you have a badge at the DEA? Sure. Or yes, I do. Yes, sir, I do. Uh, note it down. It is zero two seven eight. 
Okay. Right. This is this is my ID. Now, what okay. I want you to I do, do is I want you to get ready. You you said you want me to go ahead. Yeah, you you said you wanted me to. I think you want me to drive somewhere. Do I have to meet you at like an office right. or something? At the DEA office or something? No, no, no. No. Uh, the thing is that we are not fighting this case against you anymore. We are helping you resolve it. Okay. We're going to help you take your name out of this. Right. right. So I'm going to guide you on how you can, yeah. So I'm going to guide you on how you can safeguard your accounts and assets. First of all, I'm going to help you safeguard the bank accounts with Bank of America. Okay. And that, in that case, right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to guide you everything step by step so that you don't make any mistakes. And I will be on the line with you the whole time. So can you, you tell me if this is What are you saying safeguard my about? assets? What does that mean? That means... I'm going to help you disconnect your assets and accounts from your current social so that we can suspend your social and leave your assets and accounts unaffected. Oh, right, And tomorrow right. when you get a new social, right, right. So okay, I'm yeah. going to help you first. I'm going thank, to help you withdraw you. the funds. Thank you. Okay. Uh, l l l let me tell you what's going to happen, sir. So, All Mr. Right. Johnson, I'm going to help you withdraw the funds from the bank in the form of cash and convert it into electronic currency. So that tomorrow, when the officers visit you, they can take that electronic currency from you and they can give you a cashier check for the total value, okay? Okay, so are you uh, you're gonna get are you getting rid of my bank? No, we are actually no, we are not going to close for accounts because obviously you've got all your payments and bills set up with this account, right? Right. Right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to help you bring your accounts balances to minimum so that I can help you show these accounts as inactive and we can exempt them from being suspended. So that tomorrow when the officers visit you and give you your new social, you can directly go to the bank and update your new social there and get your funds back into your account by depositing the cashier's check. Okay? Okay, but why do I have to take it out of my bank, I guess? I guess that part I don't understand. Let me tell you. Sorry, let I, let I, me I, tell you why. Because could, could you just give right, me a new right. social it's without right. without all the fuss? That a... No, the thing is that uh, we have to take these steps. You need to understand, sir, that your accounts. Well, I mean, I'm talking about these bogus accounts. Well, these bogus accounts they have used to bogus? transfer money to Mexico and Colombia, and. Yeah, I'm, I'm not, like, let me tell you. I'm talking about the accounts that have been created by these criminals on your name. These accounts have been used to transfer money to Mexico and Colombia illegally. Now, that is the only reason we can't just possibly let you keep this money in cash, because keeping cash would be really illegal. We don't know what the to buy more drugs or something more to our country. We need to take immediate steps. This is an immediate threat to the United States. Oh, so, yeah. So, Mr. Johnson, oh, I want you oh, to cooperate. God. Right. I want you to cooperate. I want you to get ready. Yeah, Take yeah. your driver's license, your debit well, card, your credit card. anything I can do to help right. the and United to... States. I'm royal loyal. Thank you. Right. So, uh, Mr. Johnson, I want you to tell me, is this your cell phone that I'm talking on right now? Yeah. Yeah. And how, how much is the battery percentage in the cell phone? Uh, hold on, let me see if I... That's at the top, right? Uh, it says 16%. Oh, sorry, 6%. Okay. Six, it says okay, 6%. And do you have a charger? Uh, do you have a charger you can use in your car to charge your phone? Sure, you keep breaking up there. You keep breaking up. Sure, you're 
you keep breaking up. Your phone is. It sounds like it's disconnecting there. I, I don't want to lose you. Hello? I kind of hear you. It just. It, it's. Okay, uh, sir, note down a number. Can you note down my number? My callback number? Uh, note what? Oh, yeah. I want you to note down my... Go ahead. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yep. I got I got the first Is it breaking up again? I got nine one five. All right, I got it. Okay, that's it. The DEA. That's your DEA phone or whatever. No, right, right. Okay. And you can even contact me back on this. Now, listen to me very carefully, sir. I want you to understand that your phone is not having much battery on it. Yeah, so can much. you tell me? Do you have a yeah? Do you have a charger which you These can use in your car to charge your like phone? They used to. Y'all ought to investigate that. That's a crime against the American people. <laughs> sir, uh, sir, can you hear me? Yeah. Do I'm you here. have a charger which you can use in your car to charge your phone? No, it's a Toyo. It's a Camry, not a charger. It's a Toyota Camry, not a Toyota Charger. No, I, I'm, I'm asking you, sir, I'm asking you if you have a charger in your car. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I do. Okay, I want, yeah, I want you to get ready, take your driver's license, your debit card, and your credit card, and get inside your car quickly. And also plug the phone to the charge in your car quickly, right now. Uh, right now? Yes, sir, right now. We have to work this right now. We have to represent this call recording into the court, and I, I don't want you to look suspicious there. So follow my instructions. I'll tell you what you need to do. Hold up. Let me Take your time. Hold on. Sure, sure. Let me go downstairs. Sure. It will be better if you just plug the phone on the charging in the car and keep me on the line because okay, we need to on, keep this call recording in a single piece. Sure, sure, sure.
right now, not right now. Come on. Okay, give me uh, just two more minutes. Sure, sure. Just, just put the phone on the charging in your car, sir, quickly. Yeah, I'm trying to do this as fast as I can. I don't. I, I, listen, I didn't. I didn't mean to cause you sure. any trouble. I, you know, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't do this. No, it, it's all right. It, it's just that we need to make sure that we are doing this as as per the procedure, and we need right. to make sure that you don't get disconnected. So that's why I'm just rushing you to get in the car to charge your phone. Can you hear me? Can you hear me, sir? Yeah, yeah, I got you. I just hear me on speakerphone, if that's all right. That's all right, sir. And is the phone on charging? Yeah, I got to I got it plugged in. I got it plugged in. All, all right. Now listen to me carefully. I want you to go to your bank and I want you to park your car in the parking lot and say hello to me before you go what? outside of your car. So I, I, I want you to say hello to me when you park your car in the parking lot outside your bank, okay? When I, you say when I get to the bank? Right. When you get to the parking lot, when you park your car in the parking lot of the bank, Right. I want you to say hello to me because I have to, yeah, because I have to guide you what you need to do inside, okay? Okay. Uh, yeah, that's fine. That should be fine. Is it, is it, do I need an appointment? Can you call my bank for me and no, tell them I'm coming? Or no? No, no, no. No, I, I'm going to tell you what you need to do. Listen, I'm going to give you the instructions, but only when you reach the parking lot of the bank. Okay. So, so say hello to me when you reach the parking lot. When you, when you reach there, just notify me, okay? I am on the line. Hang up. Okay. All right. I'll let you know when I get there. All right. And how much time is it going to take? Maybe 10... Maybe, I guess it depends on traffic. Right now, I'm in the fast lane. I'm, tr I'm going a little over the speed limit right now. Just trying to do this for you guys. No, sir. Uh, sir, I'm about, sir I'm about you have to follow the traffic rules. I'm about 17 over the speed limit. I figure if I get pulled over, I'll just tell them I'm on the phone with a federal officer, you know? Like, what's the worst that's gonna happen? No, no, sir. <laughs> Th th this is it's unethical, sir. Something. This is unethical. I, I want Sorry. you to. Sorry. Sorry, what was that? I want you to calm yourself down, sir. I want you to calm yourself down and lower the speed limit. 
God, you God, have to follow I, the traffic I, rules. I don't want to get in trouble. I don't want to. I don't want to hold up the due process and lie. You know? Uh, that, that's all right. I mean, I, I, if you're going to go over the speed limit, you're obviously going to get into trouble. Okay, you said slow down a little bit? Yeah. The rules. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I'm just trying to I'm trying to get my GPS to work to see if I can find any way. I'm trying to figure out a shortcut so I can get to the bank, you know. I think they close early on Friday. Sir, just just let me know when you're in the parking lot of the bank, okay? Okay, hold on. Thank you for helping me, sure. officer. Thank you for helping me. My pleasure. Just let me know when you get to the parking lot of the bank. All right. Can you actually just call them and, and let them know that I'm going to be coming there? Yes, uh, right now I'm checking whether they're open or not. Oh, they're open. They're open. Oh. You can go. You can go. You, but do you want to call them? To, that way there's an appointment already in place? No, it's all right. Before you go inside, just, just let me know before you go inside. Talk to me before you go inside, and I'm going to tell you what you need to do. Okay. How much time is it going to take? Five, ten case? minutes? My, my, uh, my it, son-in-law has a friend who works in the fire department, and he knows a couple guys at the police department. I wonder if they, I wonder if they know about all this. You think I should call them? I could give them a call. No, no, no. The, 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 the thing is that right now you know, we are he, keeping he this confidential so it, at one point and they had a guy uh, from the uh -huh. secret service come down and teach him a thing or two if i remember correctly they know oh, all about okay. it. they know all about that kind okay of stuff. oh you know, if, if no it's all right health, just just let oh no you don't have to call them just let me okay. know once you get to the parking lot of the bank okay all right, well, you let me know if you think that would help. I don't mind making the call. No, it's all, it's all right. We have got all the help we need. Okay, hold on a second. I'm just going to flick the radio on. So the, the oh, no, on. don't turn it on. It's okay. What? Don't, don't turn on the radio. Do not turn on the radio. It will oh, cause you know what? interference I'll, I'll on the, the call. CD. I'll do the CD player. How can I help you if it's this noisy? What? It's way too noisy. I couldn't hear what you were saying. I had to turn it down a little bit. What was that? I'm asking you to turn it off. Turn it up? Okay. Yes. It's a good, it's a good song. Turn it off. It? Bam, 
Dylan. Can you hear me? I, I I know you wanted me to turn it up, it's just you can't hear me talking if I haven't played. So the funny thing about this band is they all the members grew up in California. There's only two members, but they play all the different instruments. They play them all and they record them separately and put it put it all together. It's it's brilliant. You you never expect any of that. The guy who plays the harmonica plays the banjo and the drums at the same time. I'm not even, I'm, I'm not making that up. You, you should look them up sometime. It's called Smite Top. Brilliant band. Officer, hello? Yes, I'm here. I'm here. Can you hear me? Hello? Are you still there? Hello? Hello? I'm here. I'm here. Yes, I'm here. Oh, sorry. I had to turn the music off. I, I thought I thought I just I thought you disappeared. Yes. I couldn't hear you. No, no. L l listen, listen, sir. Listen. You don't have to play music. I want you to turn off the music. Turn it off. Oh, I thought you said turn it up. You said turn it off. Yeah. No, okay. I told you to turn it off. Yes. I thought you maybe were a country music fan. You know, I thought you liked that kind of music. Well, I am. I am a big fan of music. Any kind of music, I'm a big fan. But oh. right now, this is a case that we are solving, and you need right. to understand that we have to do it ethically we have to follow the procedure and we yeah. do not want you to look suspicious when we represent the call recording oh okay yeah no that's that's fine you want me to play something like you want me to just turn the radio on is that what the court would want to hear like no uh, like what is it no Kesha no I, all that, I, uh, I, I, pop music sir 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 backstreet babies sir, or whatever i did no, I don't want you to play anything. Right oh. now, I want you to reach to your bank, and I want you to park your car in the parking lot, say hello to me when you're there. So, I want okay. you to tell me how much time is it going to take. The GPS says uh, five more minutes, but if you want, I can probably get us there in four if I ignore the speed limit. No. It's okay, it's okay. Stay, stay right under the speed limit, it's okay. Follow the rules. Once you're there in five minutes, say hello to me, okay? Okay, no problem, officer. I'm following the rules. All right. Sorry, just a little bit of turbulence, that's all. Just a little turbulence. Almost there, sir. Almost there, officer.
Hey, I just want to follow up. You want me to call my son-in-law and see if he can get his police officer friend involved? Just for some local help? Hello? Yes, Hello? Uh, I'm here, I'm here. Yeah, you want me to call my son-in-law and see if, if he wants to get his police officer N friend no. involved? No, sir. No. We have got all the help we need. We don't want any extra hands. If we, are, if if I would need any extra pair of hands, I would ask and I would let you know. But right now, I want you to follow my instruction as I'm telling you. So just okay. let me know once you are, uh, reach the parking lot of the bank and I'll tell you what you need to do, okay? Yeah, I'm, I'll be, I'm actually pulling in in like one minute. I'm almost here. Uh, oh. All right, let me know when yeah, you give are. Me, give me one minute. One, one or maybe two, it just sort of depends. I'm pulling up on it. All right. Sure. Okay. It doesn't look too busy right now either, so that's good to know. I didn't get a good parking spot. Okay, now listen to me very carefully, sir. Mr. Johnson, listen to me carefully. Can you hear me? Okay, hello, Mr. Johnson, can you hear me? Hello? Yeah, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Now listen to me carefully, Mr. Johnson. Yeah. I want you to go inside the bank. I want you to ask them for $5,000 in cash. Now, okay. they are going to ask you questions why they are going to ask you questions why do you need the money? I want you to tell yeah. them that you're uh, taking it for on, your personal on. I use. I brought the note paper with you're me. If you give me one second, I brought the note Okay, I have all the information, so I can tell the I can tell the bank my case number. No, 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 no. My case listen, number listen. Sir, is, sir. Or my sir, warrant listen. number uh, anyway, is five five four six four one one. And I can tell. Mr. Johnson, him, can I'm you hear me? I'm speaking with DEA agent Ryan. Zero uh, two seven no. eight one four uh, one eight eight. Sir. Is that correct? Mr. Johnson, can you hear me? Yeah. This is Richard. Mr. Johnson? Right. Richard, I want you to make sure that you do not disclose any confidential information about this case or about me in the bank. What? I want you to just go inside the bank and... Right. I want you to just withdraw 5000 You don't have to... Why not? It's because I've got a red mark on your social. If you okay. go inside the bank and tell them that there's a case, they are just going to suspend your account and they are not going to let us resolve this. So I want you to just withdraw oh, wow. 5000 cash, okay. come, come outside of the bank and say hello to me. Do not talk to me inside the bank, just keep the phone in your pocket and make sure you do not tell anyone inside the bank that you're talking to the DEA or, or that there's a warrant or a case on your name. Do you understand me? Uh. Yeah, I mean, I, you're making me a little bit nervous, though. Uh, it's it's okay. I I don't I don't really know why you're too excited, but I want you to know that this is not a game of kids. You are not here to play around. This yeah, no, is something no, no, really serious, and you have to follow my instructions. I take it completely seriously. I don't. I'm right. sorry if I ever I gave want you, you to any take a impression deep breath. that would make you think otherwise. I, this is right. You this are. Is the most serious if I've I ever tell been. you honestly, right, honestly, yeah. Richard, Richard Johnson, you're uh -huh. giving me, you're giving me a very bad impression here. Uh -huh. I want you to get. I want you to go outside. I want you to get in the bank, go to the teller, and just withdraw five thousand cash from your bank okay. account, and say hello to me when you're outside of the bank. 
Do not talk to me inside the bank. Say hello when you're outside, okay? Okay, yeah, hold on one second, actually. Hold on. I'm just going right. to put you back on speaker sure. if, that's, if that's all right with you. Richard, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah, can you hear me? Okay. Uh, yes, I can hear you. So, I'm, Richard, I'm, can I'm you tell me the, what will you tell I'm the bank? I'm going to go through the drive through window because the drive through is faster. And I, I honestly, I don't. I, my oh. knee. Okay. I've had a lot of pain in my knee, so I'm just going to go to the drive through. Oh. So I'll it's just, all right. You can go through the drive through. Right. Yeah. Just yeah, make sure yeah, you would drop yeah, 5,000 yeah. and you do not disclose any confidential information. Yeah, I'm going to put you on speaker, you, if that's okay. You can still oh. hear me, right? Sure. Hello? Uh, I can. Just just let me know once you have the cash, okay? Let me know when you have the cash. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, hold on, hold on just a second, sir. I'm just gonna go through the drive-through, and then I'm gonna go through. My bank is right next door. Okay. If that's all, if that's uh, all right. All right. If, if that's all right with you. All right, all right, all right, all right. Hello. Hello. Officer. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Who's this? Wait a moment. Let me let me connect to my office. I think He's something, I busy think, I think inside your book. Else is on the line. I think this is a compromised line. Wait a moment. Who's this? Wait a moment, sir. I am on the line. Wait a moment. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, can I get a large fry, a Big Mac, and a smoothie, please? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I don't even think he's listening right now. <laughs> okay, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. So did you get the cash? I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting for it. I'm just waiting for it. Okay. Let me know when you have the cash. Okay. Don't worry. I'm online. Don't like, mind my silence. I'm just like working on your was file. On the phone for a minute. I was a little bit confused. Oh no. Yes. That was my subordinate. Actually, I, w oh, I went into the loo. I wanted to use the washroom. Okay. You wanted to go where? All right. I want to go to the loo. I want to use the loo. Uh, are you saying that you wear Fruit of the Loom? No, I oh, said I want to use the washroom. I said I want to use the washroom. I think that you can just be in a hundred. I think hundreds are fine. Is, is it? It's okay to do $100 bills, right? Or do you want it to be? Right. It's perfect. No, $100. It's okay. Perfect. Well, do you still want bill. the 5000 or just... Hold on. I can tell him that I only need $100 no. if you want. Hey, sir! No, 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 no. You I, have to get... Sir, I hello, I hello. I need a hundred dollars, not five thousand. I was wrong. No. Sir? Hello? Can you, hello? can you hear me? Hello? Sir? Hello? Yeah. Uh, I, I only need a hundred dollar can you hear me? bill, not five thousand right now. Okay? No, no, no. Can you hear me? Hello? <laughs> Yeah, that's fine. Hello? Hello? Yeah, I'm, 
I'm here. Can you hear me? I just got to fill out a different form because the first form I filled out was for 5000 Sir, sir. Now sir, I'm just going to fill it out for sir, 100 Sir, 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 sir. Richard, Richard, listen to me. Listen to me. Richard. Yeah, I can hear you. Richard, you have to get $5,000. You asked me whether if it was okay to get $100 bills. I told I you, yes, you it's okay to get $100 bills. Okay, ma'am. I told you to get $100 bills. I didn't. Ma'am, ma'am, can you hear me? Ma'am, hello? Hello, ma'am? I need, I need 5,000. Tell the gentleman I was talking to before that I need 5,000. It's the original slip, if you don't mind. Okay, so you want five thousand dollars, not five thousand one hundred dollar bills, because I don't have that kind of cash lying around, sir. You're just saying five thousand, correct? Right. Okay. And you want that in singles, like five thousand one dollar bills, or does it matter? No, it doesn't matter, but it, okay. it would obviously be better if you get $5,000 in all $100 bill denominations. Yeah, if you could put it in the smallest denomination as possible, please. No, no, no. Oh, my God. Can you hear me, Mr. Mr. Johnson? Yeah, just put it in ones and tens or whatever the ones, tens, fives. That way it's the biggest amount of cash. I, I got a thing I'm doing, so... Yeah. Coins are fine. Yeah, if you want to do some rolls of coins, that's fine. Yep. Hello? Mr. Johnson, can you hear me? Hey, I, I took you off speakerphone for a second. I just want to let you know I got the... There's a guy in there working on it. He's going to get some rolls of quarters and pennies, nickels, dimes. He's getting ones, fives, no, tens. No, no, no. I'm just going to get as Mr. much Mr. as Johnson? I can, as, as many kind Mr. of girls Johnson? units Mr. as I Johnson? can. Uh, the cash. Oh, my so. God. Oh, my God. We're going to be able to oh represent God. the Mr. full Johnson, American I, I, currency, Mr. you know, the full... Every, every Mr. Piece, Johnson, every, yeah. Richard... Hello? Yep. Hello, Richard, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Are you trying to are you trying to test my patience, Mr. Johnson? No. I want you to get hundred dollar bill denominations. The yeah, highest I asked denomination. For some hundreds as well. And I want I asked, you to get five thousand. Well. Yeah. Not just for some hundreds. You don't have to get nickels and dimes over this five thousand dollar denomination that you were throwing here. I, I just trying to test my patience. I didn't tell you to get. I didn't tell you to get these small denominations. I told you to get five thousand dollars cash. That's it. Uh, yeah, Why are you I, trying to test my patience over and over again? Uh. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Sorry. I'm not. I. I. I'm just trying to do what. What you want me to do? I'm telling you what to do, but you're trying to add things up on yourself. I only want you to do what I'm telling you to do, okay? If I'm telling you to get $100 bill denomination for $5,000 cash, get $100 bill denomination for $5,000 cash. You don't have to get nickels or dimes. Ma'am. Excuse me. Oh, sir? Sir? Ma'am? Hello? I need, I, I don't actually need the quarters or the nickels or the dimes, just small bills are fine, no coins. Sir, can 20. you hear me? Hey, Tell uh, them you're okay with you 20. Can you hear me on the phone, Ryan? Officer Ryan, can you hear me? Yes. Sorry, I'm asking someone else. Ryan, do you want quarters or bills or just tell me? Bills. Bills. Bills, ma'am. 
build. Uh, sorry that you can't really hear Nevaeh speaking. I'm purposely, like, muffling it and making it sound... Mr. Johnson, can you hear me? <laughs> yeah, I can hear you. I, I got you off speakerphone again. Okay. Now, how much time is it going to take for you to get this $5,000 cash? <sighs> I don't know. They're, it looks like they're scrambling back there to get it all. You know, in their defense, I asked them to do quarters and everything, and then I told them not to do it, so it's kind of your fault. If you ask me. It's not my fault. I never asked you to get quarters or dimes or nickel. Yes, you did. You specifically said to do that. Oh my God! I'm trying oh. to follow the law. I did okay, not. Okay, I'm trying to follow the law. Oh, yes. Here. Okay. Okay. Right. Don't test my patience. I don't. Mr. Why Johnson, would I want? Don't test why would I want to test your patience? Why would I do that? I don't know. It might seem fun to you, but it's not. So I want you to get the five thousand cash, and that's it. Talk to me when you have the cash. Don't ask me silly questions. I'm just trying to do exactly what what you want, okay? That's it. I'm trying to help the government. Right, I'm right. doing my part as an it, American exactly. citizen, and I don't appreciate you pestering me like that. I I'm so sorry if you, if you feel like that, but again, it's way too noisy on your end, and I don't know whether you've got right, your windows you, pulled down, but I want thank you to you. pull them up. Thank you. I really up. appreciate your uh, really appreciate your help. You know what? Why don't you keep one of the tens in there? Why don't you keep a ten for your help? Oh, okay, fine. Can you can can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, now I want you to tell me. Do Hold you have any target store nearby? If you don't mind, I'm just gonna go through the drive-through next door. Give me two seconds. Sure. Uh, I just gotta whip around to the to the other. Uh, there's a McDonald's right next to it. Uh, don't go to the McDonald's, okay? Well, there's like two Do people on the line. Do not go no, to no, the I, McDonald's. I gotta, I'm a little bit hungry, okay? Give me two seconds, for God's sake. It's too late. I'm already in line anyway. I'm already in line. I can't. I can't. It's literally right next to the bank. It's very convenient. You go there and get your you get your uh, dollars and then you get your nuggets. Okay, so sir. Okay, sir. While can I'm you waiting, can you hear me? I'm waiting in line. Can you can you tell me what? Uh, can you tell me what we're going to be doing with all this cash? Right. So, can you tell me how far is the am Target I, store from your current location? And am I, am I going to be meeting you at Target? You want me to get you anything from uh, McDonald's? No, no, no. I don't want anything from McDonald's, and okay. I will not be meeting you at the Target. Oh. I want you to follow my instructions and asking unsolicited questions. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's that's no problem. That's so. Fine. Tell me, tell me, how far is the Target store from your place? Uh, probably like 20, maybe 50, uh, 10 minutes, probably 10 minutes. Okay. Uh, I'd, like a, I'd like an order of fries, make that a large fry, a Big Mac, and if you guys still have those, uh, if you guys still have those nacho cheese smoothies, that'd be great. One order of fries, I said. One order of fries. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. I, I never know what they're saying. Okay, so, so sir, I'm going to Target. What am I going to be... Am I meeting one of your officers at Target or something? No. I'm going to tell you what you have to do. But first, you have to get to the Target. So, I want you to drive there right now and listen to me very carefully. I am recording this call to represent okay. you into the court. So, make sure you okay. only talk to me when you get to the Target. Do not yeah, talk to me to while you're getting there. Oh, hi, ma'am. Yeah, hi. only talk to me when you're going to get to the target. Yeah, I only have a hundred. You mind if... I'm just going to give you a hundred. You can keep the change, darling. Okay, so, sorry, officer. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Okay, I'm... Okay, now I want you to drive to the target. How much time is it going to take for you to get there? Oh, oh come on! They forgot a straw for the... They always forget the straw for the smoothie. Hey, officer, do I have... Am I, am I meeting somebody or can I... Is it okay if I go right back through the line and ask for a straw? Or, or... Sir, right now this case is much bigger than that straw. I want you to wow. get to the target. You can get a million straw. You can get a million straws there. Why don't you go to True. the target right now? True. Okay. Yeah. Let me head to. I'll head to target. That's big brain thinking. That's that's probably why they pay you the big bucks. Say hello to me when you're in the parking lot of the Target store, okay? Okay, yeah, I mean, I'll actually, it's actually, uh, I didn't realize how close it was. It's right down the street. I can see the sign, so it'll be two seconds. It's like a giant ice cube. Just, it just slipped right down there. Timber me, timber. Okay, hold on. I'm pulling into the parking lot, officer. You have no idea what I'm going through for my country. They ought to give me a medal for this. They ought to give me some kind of medal. Sir, how much time is it going to take for you to get to the target? Can you hear me? Hello? Yes, I can. Can, can you hear me? Yeah, I just took you off speakerphone. I, I'm sitting here in the target parking lot. You just got to give me a second here. I'm going to have to eat sure. this as quick as I can, if you don't mind. <laughs> give me two seconds. It's all right. Let me know when you're done. Sure. Okay, so... Can you hear me? 
Yeah, can you tell me? Can you tell me? Can you tell me exactly what it is you're, what we're doing now? Okay. Now I want you to, I want you to walk outside of your vehicle, and I want you to go inside the target with me on the phone. Uh, and remember, you don't listen. You have to make sure that you do not let anyone know that you are here to safeguard your money. If anyone asks you uh -huh. what are you doing, just tell them that you're tell them that you're buying these cards for yourself. Now what I want you to do is I want you to go inside the target uh -huh. and I want you to look for a I want you to look for a gift card section. Say that again. Sorry. Go into the store. And what is it? Oh, look for. You have to look for a yeah. gift card section where. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Look for a gift card section where you can get Target gift cards. Yeah. So I'm getting cards, huh? Getting cards. Right. Right. Yeah. Okay. So I want you to go inside. When you see the Target gift cards, they those will be red and white in color with a Target logo on them. Uh, they would have an image of a dog on it, or yeah. probably three puppies together. Okay? I want you to go inside. I want you to go. Oh, okay, I want cool. you to go inside the target right now. I can't feel my brain right now. I can't feel my brain right now. Hold on a second, officer. I gotta. Oh, Lord. Brain freeze. Yeah, you yeah, haven't had a brain freeze before. Woo! Calm <laughs> down. Why are you drinking it? Oh, I'm you... trying to. I'm trying to do it as fast as I can for you, officer. I'm trying to do it as fast as I can. Hold on, there's a little bit of land. This is not, this is not what I asked you to do. <sighs> okay. Woo! Ah, that's good. I feel like a Eskimo here. Sir. It's a large, that's sir. a large smoothie down the gullet. Just doing my service. You know, okay. I was, I never told you I was in the military. I, I'm, I'm, I'm familiar with making sacrifices. I'm okay with this. Sir. Sir. Can you hear me? Mr. Johnson? <sighs> what? Can I have your attention, Mr. Johnson? <clears throat> Mr. Johnson? Yeah, I'm here. Yeah. Hello. I'm here. Can I have your attention, please? Uh-huh. Right. Uh, you got I me. want you, you to walk me, outside of your vehicle right now. What was that? Right. Can I want you to walk outside right now. I'm not done with the... And I'm I want you to go inside the, the target bag. right on, now. Hold on, hold on. Explain what you want me to do one more time. Let me just... Sir. I didn't ask you to get this. Uh -huh. I didn't ask you to eat this right now. What, what are you... Why are you doing this? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This is just a waste of time. Let me tell uh -huh. you. Uh-huh. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. <coughs> okay. <coughs> okay, officer, I'm good to go now. I promise. I'm. I'm. Uh, the whole. The, the half the Big Mac's done. Smoothie's done. Tell me what we're doing. Tell me what we're doing, and I'm here for you. Okay. I appreciate your help. Tell me what we're doing. Officer, hello. Okay, okay. Now you're done, right? Yeah, I'm done. I got the whole the whole thing taken care of. Okay. Yeah. Great, great. You Good know, job. I'm a, I'm a part now, of the generation the where we, you know, we don't waste food. You know, you, you eat all the food on the table. <laughs> right. My parents were. You're you know, right. They you're were right. in the Great Depression. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like they grew up during the Great Depression. Right. So I don't, I don't mess around. You know, I was a kid. I was. Uh, I was just a twinkle in my my mother's eye then, but uh, anyway.
All right, so I have the cash. Okay. I've got... Uh, go, go inside the Target store. Yeah, I got 4,900. 4, go inside the Target. I got 4,900. Okay, that's all right. I okay. want you to go inside the Target store right now. And I want you to look for Target gift cards. Yeah. Do that right now. Why? Why are you not moving? Move, well, move. Sorry, I was, move. I was under the impression. I was under the impression that I was helping you with a federal case to get a new social security number. So is there like a federal officer meeting me at the parking lot or what? What are no, we doing now? Uh, first of all, you have to. Right now, you are going to safeguard these $4,900 that you have. And for that, you have to go inside the target. When you will be inside the target, you will have to look for a target gift card. So, uh, once okay. you are in front of these target gift cards, say hello to me. Okay, so you're thinking if I buy some stuff at Target, it proves my innocence, is it? Because I don't mind buying stuff. I mean... No, no, I don't want you to buy stuff. I want you to buy gift cards and put your money in them. This is how we are actually okay. going to keep it safe. Okay, well, I know you were saying, uh, I know you were saying I could get a million straws in there, too, so... I mean, whatever, whatever I gotta do for the country, officer, it's, you know... Uh, it's, you know, that's fine. That's fine. Don't, don't get straws, okay? okay? all right. Don't uh, start getting straws let me, now. Do I to call you back then? Or, let me, uh, actually, let me get out of the car. Let me, let me put you on speaker. Hold on. I never knew Target was so involved with the DEA. That's good to know. Calm yourself down. Why are you trying to make this a fuss? Do you have another? Can you hear me, Mr. Johnson? Yeah, it's just a little windy outside. Hold on. Do you have Yeah, I'm here. Okay. I got gotcha. you. Um, okay. I want you to... Okay, now listen to me carefully. Sir, Mr. Johnson, only follow my instructions. I want you yeah, to look for yeah, Target gift the, card. I'm just in Target right now, so I'm going to do a little bit of shopping. Okay. See what I can dig up here. For you the, are not doing and, a little bit of shopping. Uh, holy... Um, Holy I'm, I'm moly! Are you the, even listening to what to I'm like saying? The, the area where they had got the paper plates and cups and all those things. I'm gonna see if I can find um. Oh my! Pick up a couple straws, because I know you said. I mean, Holy I just gotta spend crap. the money, right? I just gotta spend it all, and then no. Do I get like a receipt at the no. end? No. <clears throat> no. Oh, I kid you not. No, There's Mr. A Johnson. No. There's a security guard. Is it him? Am I meeting him? He's, there's like the target security guy? No, Mr. John... Mother Yo, should I talk no, to Mr. him? No, Mr. Johnson. Teri maki yeah. chut. Hello. Hey, Hello. Hey, Hello. Can you hear me, Mr. Johnson? Sir, if you don't mind, I got a question. If you don't mind coming over here, we got a little bit of a case going on. I got the... I'm trying to get the security guy to come over. Hold on. <clears throat> don't. Oh, mother should. Wait, you don't... You don't want to talk to him? I thought that's who I was meeting. No, no. Oh, never mind. No, never mind. no, no, Mr. Johnson. 
Never mind, sir. All good here. Mr. Johnson, Mr. Mr. Johnson, can you can you hear me, Mr. Johnson? Yeah, I, I can hear you. Sorry. Hello, Mr. Johnson. I I'm want here. you to look for ta Mr. Johnson. I want you to look for Target gift card. Yeah, no, I'm. Sorry, I'll pick up the pace a little bit. <laughs> Mr. Johnson, can you hear me? Yeah. I want you to look for Target gift card. Target store gift card. Mr. Johnson, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I haven't ran like Mr. that in a Johnson, while. I want you to look for. Oh. Mr. Johnson, I want you to look for Target store gift card. I'm a little lost here. I just started running and I realized. So I'm trying to do this as fast as I can. I just don't know. Um... I've never been to this particular store. I always go to the one closer to my house. Uh, okay, well, Mr. Johnson, gosh. can you still hear me? I am not young, that is for sure. Uh, okay. Mr. Johnson, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Do you know uh, which aisle... Can you... <coughs> Sorry. Oh. Uh, do you know which aisle has the... Uh, the, uh, the cards you're talking about. I could see the bicycles. The Target there's, gift card? There's bicycles where I am. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, do one thing. Ask ask from a storekeeper there. Ask okay. from a storekeeper, where are the Target gift cards? Okay, you want me to just ask about... Ta yeah, that's... Okay, hold on. Let me see if I can flag someone down. It's a good idea. Somebody, I could get someone from security if you want. Would you like? Would you like me to do that? Okay. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah. No. No problem. Sorry. I didn't mean to. All right. Okay. Have a good. Have a good day. Okay. Hey, ma'am. Ma'am, you work here. Yeah, I'm okay. just looking for uh, gift cards. Yeah, so I would say, I would say somewhere on uh, 7, across over okay. there from, there's like the makeup yeah. area, it's over there. Right? Yeah. Okay, so you're talking like down there on the left. It's just I got official government business, I'm trying to do it as fast as I can. You don't, you don't happen to know if there's any, like, was there anyone here before from the, the like, DEA or anything like that? Uh, I'm actually not familiar with that. Okay. Because I think I'm but, supposed to be uh, meeting some could, federal could officers like, here. I could get somebody, I could get someone from security if you want. Um, I like, don't know. Would you like me to do that? I don't know. Uh, hold on one sec. <laughs> hey, Ryan, should I ask her to find out if anyone from the DEA has been here yet or not? No, I just want you to look for Target store gift cards and when uh, you're in front mind, of them, let just, me know. Okay, sorry, sorry. Yeah, no, yep. no, no problem, sir. I didn't mean to. That's fine, I, that's fine. I, I just got official have business. Have yeah, bye. Okay. <laughs> she was very nice. <clears throat> so she said it's over by aisle seven. And, uh, just gonna see if I can find it. Uh, hold on. <clears throat>
Okay, I'm looking at a bunch of them right now. Um, they've got. Do you, do you see Target? They've got plastic. Do you they see Target? Tar they've got recycled ones. They've got paper ones. Um, no, I so want you to about, look for uh, Target gift cards. I'm talking about straws. I was asking. I, I'm just looking at straws. How many do you want me to pick up? You think? You said a million, but that seems like a lot. Oh my God! Uh, oh, oh my God, sir, sir, can you how, hear me? How many do you need? Um, can you hear me, Mr. Johnson? Yeah. Because I can hear you perfectly, and I can only sense you testing my patience. Can you just go ahead and look for Target store gift cards? You don't yeah, have to pick up straws. Not even well, I mean, a single one. Mind, no, I don't mind you're not picking straws. up straws here. You, you told me to get them earlier. You're mind. not getting straws. Oh my God, this this is so absurd. You're uh, not getting straws, okay? Okay, so just the gift cards, or because they got the spinny curly yes, ones. You, you just like those. you just have to take. Oh my God, just have to go to the gift card section. How many times do I have to tell you <laughs> that you don't have to get straws? Okay, I'm just... Uh, Alright. Um, let me head over there to the... <laughs> Sorry about that, sir. It's okay. God, it's busy here for a Friday. <laughs> Everyone's huddling around these pokey main cards. I don't know what that's all about. It's all right. Can you hear me, Mr. Johnson? Okay, I'm looking at a bunch of gift cards now. They got GameStop, AMC, okay. Theaters, Tesla, you need to, you need the to whole look nine for... yards. Uh, oh my. Okay, okay. sir. I'm just going to get a little bit of Mr. everything, Johnson. I guess. Um, or should I... No, Mr. Johnson, no. Mr. Johnson, oh, you can you I hear me? Do? Do you want me to ask, is, is there like a DEA? Let me see if these are alphabetical. Uh, Denny's. I see Denny's, but I don't see DEA. No. Mr. Johnson, say, can you, you hear is me? Is there like a USA? Or a... No. No, no, Mr. Johnson, can you hear me? Or what, what, what am I looking for? No. Oh my god, Mr. Johnson, are you listening or not? Yeah, I'm listening. I got you. I'm here. I you have you. to look for Target gift cards. Yeah, I'm literally Target here right gift now. Cards. I'm literally at the Target gift cards. That's what I'm no, saying. No, uh, they, they would have a Target logo on them. They would have a Target logo on them, probably an image of a dog. An image of a dog? Right, with the Target logo. Uh, hold on. Sure. So I'm just looking for a... Target gift card. You're looking for a Target gift card. Okay. Uh, okay, yeah, so it literally, I might be a little bit confused here, sir, but literally every single one of these cards are sold by Target, I think. They're all Target cards right so I'm in Target and I've got Apple Google GameStop Barnes & Noble Bass Pro Shops Xbox Starbucks AMC Chipotle everything McDonald's sir look for Target gift cards oh my god how many times do I have to tell you that you have to look for Target gift cards they got Steam gift cards too. Oh, you you just mean like Target? Like Target store gift cards, yes. Oh, like so you can buy more things at Target. Okay. Uh, right. Okay. 
that's fine. Can you hear me? Richard Johnson. Oh, that's not. Uh, yeah, I'm here. I'm just trying to find them. There's a whole bunch of cards here. Just give me a second. Right. Uh, they've got like five. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Target for a hundred bucks. Right. Fifty dollar card. Hold on. Target, 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 target. There's not very many cards. I'm trying to think. So you want I me to want just to... put all of oh my, my money? Oh my god. You want to put all my money on these cards, the target cards? Yeah. Is that what you want? First, first of all, I want you to tell me what cards are you looking at? Are these targets? Yeah. What type what type of cards do are they? I mean take your pick. You got Starbucks, Chipotle, Disney, Barnes and Noble, Target. I want you Home to Home Depot. Yeah, Target, Target. Game, game right. Stop, You've got Xbox. Target cards, right? Yeah. You you've got Target right. I yeah. want you to pick up four Target cards. Right, pick up four cards. Okay. Just four of them? Yeah, first of all, yeah, first you gotta pick four at least. I don't know whether you're doing the right thing or not. So I don't want you to waste your money. Pick four Why cards. Would I wait? What do you mean to waste my money? Out. I mean, isn't the whole point just to put my money on these gift cards so I can keep it safe from the government? Right. But that does not mean that you can put the money in any sort of gift card. You have to get a specific gift card that is actually safe. So I want you to get Target gift cards, pick four of them, go to the self-checkout machine. Now, do you know what the self-checkout machine is? What? Maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never really, I don't really use those, but I, yeah. yeah, I know what you're talking about. It's, it's okay. It's okay, yeah. You just gotta go to the self-checkout machine. You gotta scan one card put 500 on it and get the receipt test. now you test. have to repeat the same process test. for all four test. of them and i want you to get out test. i want you to take out four receipts and say hello to me when you've got these four cards with you with four receipts okay four individual receipts i don't want you to scan more than one card at a time you can only check out one card at a time okay richard johnson please report to customer service Richard Johnson, please report to customer service. Thank you. Pager Richard Johnson, please come to the front desk. Can you hear me? Richard Johnson, please report to the customer service. Thank you. Hello? I'm here, I'm here. I'm just trying to collect as many of them as I can. I'm sorry. Sorry. It's okay. It's okay. Let me know when you have didn't, four target gift cards <laughs> with you, okay? Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna... There's only like six here, so I'm just gonna get all six of them. If that's okay. Sure. And then I'll probably grab that's some all right. of the... Let like me Chipotle? know. Chipotle? Are you more of a Chipotle or a Five it's Guys? Them, them. No, no, you no. like Five Guys? Just get... No. You, uh, let, okay, let me ask no. it a different way. Are you a pizza guy? A burger guy? Or are you like coffee? You pick. You tell me, I officer. want to get Target. Only Target. Only Target. Oh. Can you the, hear me, Mr. Right, the Johnson? The government only wants only Target, get the target. Cards. Okay. No other cards. Right, right. You're right. Calm yourself down. Wait. That was my name. It just said don't, Richard. Don't. 
Richard Johnson report to customer don't, service? Don't. Hold on. I, I gotta figure out don't, where customer don't service Don't go there, is. Mr. Johnson. Oh my god, Mr. Johnson, don't do that. Why oh. are you not listening to me? Hold on, I just... Hold on. I, I could have sworn Johnson, was, I don't swore that do was that. my name. That was your name. Uh... Don't okay, go there me, right now. Let me grab these first, cards first. Let me grab the cards these first. Cards. Let me grab the cards first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I'm gonna grab go the cards. Cash just... these cards. Very fancy lunch party. It's possible it's not me, right? There's other Johnsons that live in the area. I mean, not the only Johnson, right? I guess it's entirely, it's entirely, yeah. I, I don't know. I don't know. Are you part of our member rewards? What do they say at Target? I don't. What do they say? Are <laughs> you buying all these for a big birthday party or something? Oh. Okay. That's... You know, you might actually want to talk to someone about that, because that doesn't make a whole lot of sense, actually. But, I mean... Um, alright, officer. We're almost to the whole of a stretch here. I'm just waiting in line. Do you guys have technology? Does the government have technology to see people in the store at all? Because the guy in the guy in front of me bought. He's buying enough. Uh, you hear that, baby? God, Hello. Gotta hate babies. Yeah. Are you able to see inside Hello? Of the store right now? Hello. Can you hear me? Sure. Officer. Hello? Right. Hello? 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 Listen to me. Can you see inside of the store right now? Because I'm in line, and the guy in front of me, he's buying... He is buying enough DVDs for a small army, and nobody watches DVDs anymore, and it's got me a little concerned. I mean, the guy's got, like, a cart full of them. What is he doing with DVDs? Is gonna grind that down? Are they gonna grind that down for drugs or something, officer? You think he... I don't know if you can look. I'm in aisle. Uh, sorry, the the line is number six. Guy, he's got like a funny looking hat on. Damn, 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 damn. Oh. <laughs> There's some lady with toilet paper on her shoe. <clears throat> Okay, here we go. Hi, thank you. Oh, I almost forgot the straws. Get these straws too, man. Get the straws too. Are you buying all these for a big birthday party or something? No, 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 no. Oh. It's like a, it's a government thing. It's a government thing. <laughs> You, know, you might actually want to talk to someone about that because that doesn't make a whole lot of sense, actually. No, it's fine, it's fine. Would Richard Johnson please report to customer service? Richard Johnson, please report to customer service. Thank you. God. That's starting to freak me out. That's starting to freak me out. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Thank you. <sighs> okay, officer. I think we're I think we're nearing the home stretch here. I think we're we're about done with this first part of the mission or whatever. Richard Johnson, please report to the customer service. Thank you.
except I really got it. Hey, uh, uh, Ryan, you still there? Ryan, hello? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, mm -hmm. okay, so what do you want me to do with these? You want me to set these cards somewhere uh, first, or I gotta, I gotta see what the customer service is all about. Um, what, what are we doing here? You gotta, gotta update me. Where are we at? Can Hello? you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Did you get the cards? Yeah. Wait, who was on the phone? Oh, I'm whatever. Ryan. Okay, maybe some maybe it was someone else. Uh, sir? Ryan. I'm here. Yes. What do you What do you want me to do? Cause I gotta go to the front desk before I get out of here. So what do you want me to do? I want you to get Target gift cards. I How did. much time bought, is it gonna I take me to get the Target? You already bought them. Why weren't you listening to me? I just told you that. Okay. I, I literally you just already told bought you. them. <laughs> you know what? Let me call you back. Cause okay. I'm gonna go to the front desk and make sure everything's no, okay. No, no, and then I'm no, no. Gonna, no. Uh, uh, Listen that, to me. Mr. After Johnson, that, uh, Mr. Johnson. You, okay. Oh my God, Miss Mr. Johnson, Miss Johnson. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. If you want, I can keep are you, you on the phone. Are, are you listening? I do I need to keep you on the phone? Is no, 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 no. Miss Miss Johnson, can you tell me, did you get the cards? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, I got the cards. I have purchased okay. the cards. Okay. Okay. Did you you purchased them, right? You've yes. already paid for them, the right? The goose is in the hen house. Yes. Yes. Okay, now I I want you to okay now I want you to open one card. Sure, I gotta go to the front desk. I gotta go. Hold on. Okay. No. Uh, on. Yeah, dude, go to the front desk after this. Right now, I want you to open one card. Please report to the customer service. Thank you. Just give me a minute. Just give me a minute. I'll figure it out. That, 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 I can actually see that girl I talked to earlier. She's waving at me. She's trying to get my attention, so uh, I'm just gonna go talk to him and we'll. Oh, there's a. Can you uh, hear that, me? Yeah, that security John, guy's Ms. over there too. That's Ms. cool. Miss Miss Mister Johnson, oh, can you hear it? me? Is this the drop-off point? Okay, I'm. I am so excited. No, I am no. more excited about this than I thought I would be. This feels like an action movie. <laughs> So, okay, I'm heading over there. Uh, mission accomplished. So I'm going to give the gift cards to the security guy, and I'll, and I'll tell him everything that's no, going on. No, no. And that'll be, we'll, we'll no, get that. No, Mr. Johnson. We'll get that going, no. All right? Give me two seconds. I'm gonna put no, you, I can no. Put you on no, speaker, Mr. But I'm, Johnson. I'm going to head right over there. Mr. Hold on. Johnson, I'm saying no. I'm saying no. Uh oh, he just hung up on me. He's getting angry. Well, sir, the problem is here, I don't think you're working with a federal officer, and this kind of lady right here alerted me to your situation. I think you may be a little bit confused. Uh, maybe, maybe you could come with me to the office, maybe hang up the phone. How sure are you that the guy you're talking to is a federal officer? I mean, federal officers don't just call people and ask them to go to Target. That don't make no sense. Well, sir, the problem is here, I don't think you're working with a federal officer and this kind of lady right here alerted me to your situation. Hmm. I think you may be a little bit confused. Well, well I mean, uh, Maybe, maybe you could come with me to the test. office. Maybe hang up the phone. All right. Let me call this guy back. I mean, either way, that was a lot of fun. He probably... If I don't talk to him again, this is basically the end of the scam. Uh, if you didn't know, they... This is it. They want the gift cards. So, um... <laughs> either way, that was a lot of fun, and he wasted uh, about two hours. But I'm going to call... Um, I'm going to call him back. He probably thinks that it's over now.
because that's literally what I was setting him up for <laughs> is that I'm going to go walk over to the to the agent or whatever and he's going to ruin everything. But Either way, let's let's see. Wait, that was the officer. <laughs> that's the officer calling. Announcement. <laughs> no Announcement. <laughs> Announcement. Hello? Hello? Yeah, hello. Who is this? Yeah, what happened? We got disconnected. Uh, Ryan? Yes, Ryan. Oh. Uh, I tried calling you. I tried calling you a bunch of times. Okay. Uh, so, so where are you right now? Uh, I'm sitting here. I'm sitting here, kind of in the back office, waiting for the uh, the security guy to come over. Why? Okay. Uh, so, do you have the cards with you right now? Yeah. Yeah, I got the cards, but okay. Uh, just sort of. Okay. To now li this listen out. to me carefully, Mr. 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 Johnson. Listen to me carefully. Yeah. I want you to pick up one card, and I want you to take it out of the package. The card is in a small package, right? Yeah, that's correct. Yeah, take take the card out of the package. Uh -huh. Okay, hold on. Uh-huh. Okay. Now what? Now, I want you to look at the back side of the card. You will be able to see that there's a silver stop. panel there. Sir, stop. There's stop. a silver part you which you can scratch, you which you can scratch cards, off. Uh, okay. Right next the to the barcode, the do you see there's a silver panel that says gently remove the scratch to check balance? Maybe I can, uh... Yeah, you, there's like a thing I gotta scratch off. I could maybe with my keys. Yep. I want you to scratch it off. I want you to scratch it off gently. Okay. Do not, do sure not, you don't want me to do not scratch it hard. Just because I got the security guy coming any second now. Uh, I, I thought I was. It's all right. I want you to scratch guy. off. I want you to scratch off this card. Okay. Hold on. Give me a second. Give me a second. Sir, sir, stop! Stop! Don't you give him those cards! Don't you give him those cards, sir! No, what are you talking? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Well, sir, the problem is here. I don't no, think you're I... working with a federal officer, and this kind of lady right here alerted me yeah. to your situation. Right. I think you may be a little bit confused. Uh, maybe, maybe you could come with me to the office and hang up the phone. No. I... I mean, I, I don't think you understand. This is officer. Actually, let me just put you on speakerphone. This guy, he works for the the, the DEA. Uh, how sure are you that he the guy you're talking to is a federal officer? Hey, can you hear? I mean, federal officers don't just call He's people. He's the DEA. His name's Ryan. His name's Ryan. Ryan, can you can you hear? I got you on I got you on speakerphone. Can you hear? Can you hear everyone? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, officer I can. Ryan. Is that you, Officer Ryan? Hello? Yes, that's me. Hello? Hello? Uh, yeah, we can hear you. We can hear you. That's me. I said that's me. Okay. Uh, Agent Ryan, uh, sorry, who who is it that you work for exactly? Could you please explain to me who, who it is you're working for? I, I work for the I United States Drug Enforcement Administration. Now, I want you to pass the let, phone let to Mr. Johnson. It. Let him say it. Let him say it. Who do you work for? I work for the DEA. Okay, can you give me your badge number and your area jurisdiction, please? Uh, this is sure. You're, you're being good. I'm in El Paso. Being, like, really My badge cool. number is zero two uh -huh. seven eight two yeah four one eight eight. Okay, okay. Is this man in trouble, sir? Is this man in trouble? Because he was walking around the store doing all kinds of all kinds of stuff. This is. 
you're, you're he, being he was trying to buy like really yeah. gift cards. Yeah, uh, actually, uh, let me tell you. Uh, well, someone is trying to fraud this man, and we are just trying to get his help to catch those criminals. So can you please pass the phone to Mr. Johnson? Okay, now what exactly did he do? Because, uh, you know, this is my part-time job. I actually am a, I'm a law enforcement officer myself. I work I work here in the, in downtown Chicago. So uh, w what's going on? W what exactly happened here? I already told you the DEA. What, what? Yeah, I mean, I know he works for the DEA, but uh, you want me to arrest him? You want me to arrest him? Hey, hey! No, no I don't want innocent. you to arrest this guy. I want you to just pass the phone and leave him to me. No, I'm, I'm guiding your, him, listen, and he, got, will, he is in good hands. I'm your boots on the ground. I'm your boots on the ground. You want me to rough him up a little bit, detain him or something? You want me to do that? No, you're, no, no, that's all right. I just want you to pass out. the phone to him. He's you're all right. He's doing out. fine. Listen, listen. What? Tell me about the. Tell. Don't you go anywhere. Don't you sit right down. You sit down. Thank you. Why don't you tell me about the case? And uh, if you want, I can get. I can get dispatch on the phone. I think he's looking to run. He's fixing a run right now. Sir. Man, he's fixing a run. Me, I I, What's I, your I name? Swear, I swear on the sweet Lord, baby Jesus' name, I will tackle you in this store. I have a taser. Okay, sorry. Hello? Let me just, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I took it off speakerphone, sir. I want you to understand uh, that I am fully Can you qualified. Please pass I, I am the phone fully qualified to handle this situation. I don't have um, to talk to you. If you want to you. look up You're my badge number. You're not qualified to talk to me. I would request you to pass for Mr. John. Uh, looks like we got a runner. Looks like we got a runner. Hold on. Oh, he hung up. <laughs> I'm surprised he even talked to me. Uh, <laughs> Looks like we got a runner. Jeez. Okay, let me pause it. I couldn't decide if I wanted to have the officer fall for the scam and be like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My, like, my mother-in-law did, you know, my mother-in-law did. That. Like my father, my father actually had the same thing happen to him a couple months ago. He, he you know, his whole bank account drained for the, co for the cause, you know? I, I'll help this guy. <laughs> yeah, I can, I can help him. I can help him get more cards. I couldn't tell if I wanted to go that route or, or this route. But oh, I have an idea. This will be ridiculous, but hello, sir, Richard. I'm sorry, Ryan. Right, I'm here. It's Richard. I'm in the bathroom. Hi, Mr. Jet. Mr. Johnson, how are you doing? I'm I'm not good. I'm in I'm I'm in the bathroom. I got that speakerphone. Okay, so do you have the cards with you? I I only could grab a couple of them. Okay, so I want you to I want you to open one card, and I want you to scratch it off from the back. Hold on. Do you have any other bank accounts? Okay. I have, I have, I was able to grab two of the cards. I don't think the police, I don't think that guy knows where I am. I don't Did you scratch know. them? Uh, no, not yet. Let me know once you've done, once you're done scratching the cards. 
Mr. Johnson, please report to the front office. Oh, God, they're looking for me. I'm sorry? They're looking for me, I said. They're looking for me. I thought you... Why is that guy... He, he said he was going to, like, arrest me or something. I thought he was here to help me. Just just do what I'm telling you to do. Okay. Scratch the back of the card. I'm, I'm going to scratch it. I'm going to scratch it. Okay? I'm working on it. Hold on. Okay. Sure. I'm testing something. I'm testing. Something. Did you scratch one card? Hold on. <laughs> Did you hear that? Oh, it's so. Hello. Uh, yeah, I got it mostly scratched. It's just kind of hard to get the last. It's kind of hard to get the last part. Hold on. Okay, I want you to tell me the card number. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Uh, okay, just almost done. <sighs> What's the card number? Okay. Um, uh, God, it stinks in here. Hello? Hello? Richard Johnson, please report to the front office. Richard Johnson, please report to the front office. I, I think someone's in here. Hello? I think someone's in here. I think someone's in here. I, th I think there's someone. Listen, tell me the card number. Richard. Just tell me the goddamn card. Richard, are you in here? I swear to God. Oh, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Richard, if, Richard, if you're in there, you have the right <laughs> oh to God. remain Sir. silent. Sir. You have the right to an Ryan. attorney and the due process of law. Ryan. I Here, I want you to tell me the card the number. Air. Ryan. Ryan, I'm going to count to ten before I start kicking these doors in. What do you want me to do, Ryan? I don't know what to do. Tell, tell me the tell, tell me the card Richard, number. Richard, I don't know if you're doing whatever in there. You know, you, I, I know this is a bathroom I, and everything, but I'm gonna not, need you. I'm gonna need you to come up with your hands in the air right now. It's it's not me. It's not me. Uh, hello. Who who is that? It's not it's not Richard. Okay, I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm sorry, ma'am. I must have gone in the wrong bathroom. I apologize. I apologize. Sorry. Have, a, have a good day, ma'am. Okay, that that was a good show right there. Okay, tell me the okay. card number now. Was it? Okay. D tell me the yeah, card number now. You can you can subscribe for free with Twitch Prime. So. Okay. What's, um, what's the card number you see in the back? Let me see. Um, I'm trying to figure out where I put the card. You think he believed that? I, that guy is... Okay. Okay, the cards. Uh... You should have the cards right now. Wait yes. Till I, I'm a, yes. I gotta finish. Sorry, I gotta finish scratching. I gotta finish scratching it. Okay. 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 You done? Okay, I think so.
Okay, tell me the card Sorry, number. I gotta stand up because it's starting to get really awkward in here. I, I don't normally sit like this for long. Oh, God. What's, oh. The, what's the card number? Oh, I just dropped one of the cards in the toilet. Give me a second. I gotta... Yeah, you did. You dumbass. Don't call this number again. Okay. <clears throat> Here we go, officer. Uh, hello? Yes, yeah, I'm here. Sorry, I could have swore I heard you say something. I just wasn't. I wasn't sure what you said. Okay. You said that you were going to tell me the card number, so go ahead. What's the yeah, card number again? Yeah, uh, so I got the first the first one here. Uh, it's, it starts with 0, 4, 1. Uh-huh. That's, that's the first three digits. And it, how is this exactly going to help the case? Richard, if you're in there, Just tell me the card number, and I'll tell you after it, okay? Oh, What's God. the card you number? To an attorney in the due process of law. It, you've already been in here. You've already been in here. Richard, I know that you. I can see. I can see you right there. I can see you through the crack. I need you to come out right now. <laughs> The goddamn now, right now. Brian, I need you to talk to this guy. I need you to talk to this guy. I'm gonna put you on speakerphone again. I'm gonna put you gotta walk. You gotta walk me through this. Tell timers right now, Richard. I want you to shut up and come out with your hands up. You're under arrest. I, I have you on speakerphone. I have you on speaker. I don't. I don't care. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> He's getting so. He's like, just give me one of the cards before you get arrested, please. What's the card tell, number? Tell him I'm the DEA. Tell him I'm the DEA. He's the, the DEA. The, he's the DEA. Tell him I'm. Tell him he. Can you hear me, sir? I listen. I got the. I got the suspect apprehended. I have him in handcuffs. <clears throat> I just need to know what you want me to do next. He's sitting here right there in the bathroom in the in the target. You need me to bring him down to the uh, the the department, the 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 police station. You tell me what to do, sir. I'm. I'm yeah, I that got would be. Uh, that, that. Listen, listen, listen to me. Yeah. He has he has a Target gift card. Yeah, and I want you to tell me the number at the back of the card. Okay, before we do that, I need to know. You want me to book like bag him and tag him, book him, put him, bring him back, bring him down to the office. Yeah, that would be nice. What the heck is bag him and tag? Him? Okay, okay, and you said you need the gift. You need all the gift cards or. I want you to tell me how many gift cards does he have right now? Uh, okay. I mean, there's one card, sir. There is one card in the toilet, and there is one card on his position. Okay, I want you to grab the card that's in his possession, and I want you to look at the back side of the card. You'll be able to see that there's a scratch panel which you just scratched up. And the okay, hold on, hold on a second, there. sir. Hold so on a second. Let me... Yeah, we got a floater in there as well. There is no way I'm putting my hands in that toilet, sir. I'm sorry. I'm not uh, asking you to put your hands in the toilet. Did you even listen to me, God damn it? I want you I want you to take the card that's in his possession, that's in his hand. And I want you to pick the card up, and I want you to look at the back side, and I want you to tell me the number. Okay, hold on. Uh, God, it smells in here. I swear that guy... So listen, I have one of my, my I have my assistant deputy. He, they're bringing him back into the car for questioning. Holy moly! So I have the car. I want you to tell I have me the, the card the here, car, and it looks it. like uh, don't ask me. Wait. It looks like it has been scratched a significant amount, uh, almost as if he he purposely scratched the numbers off of it. 
I, I can only make out a couple to. You know what? You, a, you a couple of the take, numbers take here. Guy and get him to the uh, station. I don't care. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Bring him to the station. I don't care. <laughs> what a jerk. <laughs> He really wants that gift card. <laughs> oh my gosh, poor Richard. Let me call let me call back. The number you are trying to reach is no longer he in service. He blocked me. That's okay. I'll call from I'll call from my Oh, he hates me. <laughs> Mission accomplished. I'm glad that it I'm glad that we got to call him back uh for sure. This is more what I was hoping would happen. Okay, let me call back. Um It's fine. I've already taken that. Uh, I've already. It's fine. Thank you for calling. Can I help today? Uh. Yeah, uh, yeah, hello, hello. Hello, yeah, can you hear me now? Yeah, is Officer Ryan from yeah. the DEA available? Give me a moment. Thank you. Let me transfer this call to my chief officer, Officer Ryan. Give me a moment. It Th may take a moment. Hold the line. Yeah. Hold the line for a moment. Okay, thanks. Yeah, hello. Hello. Yeah, Officer Ryan. Hello. What do you, what do you want? Officer Ryan. Uh, Officer Ryan, are you there? Oh man, he can't hear me. It's like disconnecting. Social security, how can I help it? Uh, yeah, can I please speak with Officer Ryan? Tell him it's uh, tell, tell him it's uh, Ab I you have the cars that he was talking about. You son of a bitch. I have the son cars he was talking about. I apprehended the criminal. I, I just need to talk to Officer Ryan. You listen to me, yourself, and yourself. You I'm sorry, got... you're breaking up there. Oh, like you said, you softball. What was that? Okay, it's officially, it's officially over. <laughs> I don't, one way or another, it's over. Um, feels good, man.